you follow high school football, you know Maury has become a staple of the postseason. The Commodores winning it all back in 2019, beginning a stretch of four straight years as one of the final four squads in Class 5. But to see what's driving them this year, you have to look at where they've fallen short. One, two, three, three, four, five, six. Commodores. As Maury kicks off its preseason camp, there's one word at the center of it all. We haven't been able to finish. Everything is to just finish. State championship Saturday in December has featured the Commodores in each of the last two years, but they've fallen just short. It's what drives their mission in 2023. You're going to keep hearing that over and over. I'm pretty sure that, um, you know, this is not going to be the last interview, but it's just about finishing when it counts. That's, that's all we're trying to fight for this year. Going all the way. You know, that's been the whole point, you know, the whole thing with all of this, you know. So we, he put emphasis on us finishing this time. It's a group that knows how to win. 17 starters back from last season, leaving head coach Doree McCain feeling good about the approach. Just the experience back there and understanding what it takes to get there, how, to, how we prepare. That's the part I said. I, I, I'm not worried about that part at all because we understand how to practice. We understand how to prepare. It's, it's really solely just about finishing. The road to finishing is a gauntlet. The Commodores will navigate a schedule that sees two defending state champs in Highland Springs and Dinwiddie, along with Maryland powerhouse wise. We're expecting to win. Um, obviously, those teams that are coming to play are expecting to win too. Um, but should be good games, good talent, good coaching, good programs. Good programs just like Maury, which comes in with a senior class that hopes to finish its career with the ultimate prize. It would mean a lot because, you know, since I've been a freshman, we came up short every year. So for us to finish this year, it'll be a, be good. This group hasn't won one yet. So, um, so and, you know, that group wants to, wants to be able to leave out and be able to call this up a state champion, get their jacket, get that ring, and, um, and, we, and we, we plan on doing that. Now, Maura kicks off the season September 1st with that game at Wise in Maryland.